welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. If you are new, I'd love it if you'd hit that subscribe button down below. It would just make my day. It's currently 12.30 at night and I'm filming this video because I just finished packing for my trip for the flight that I have to be on at 6 a.m. and have to leave my house at 4 a.m. but I wanted to film this video. So for today's video, I wanted to show you guys what's in my carry-on bag for traveling. Um, maybe you have a trip coming up and you want some ideas of what you need to pack or maybe you're just curious, I don't know. So my flight leaves at 6 a.m. I have to leave my house at like 4 a.m. Then I have two five hour flights. So I figured to film this and then I'll have something to do on the flight, which is editing this video. And if you wanted to know where I'm going, I'm going to Hawaii. So make sure you're subscribed because I will be posting a ton of videos from Hawaii as well as back to school videos and all other kinds of videos. So make sure you are subscribed. Along with that, when I hit 500 subscribers, I will do a giveaway. So another reason to be subscribed. <laughs> all right, so let's get started. So this is my carry-on bag. It's actually my old school backpack and it's just a black Jansport backpack and I like it because it holds quite a bit of stuff but it's easy to carry and I prefer backpacks over like a shoulder bag when I'm traveling because the backpack kind of evens out the weight and you kind of have your hands free which I personally really like. So let's start with the big pocket. So in this big pocket, starting off, I have my Beats headphones. I have these because you need music and you need headphones to edit on a plane and stuff. So these are great, but they're noise canceling. So next, I have my little mini beauty bag thing. I have like mascara and concealer and like a mirror and blotting sheets in here. I think that's about it. But from, oh, and lip balm, so my lips don't trap. Um, but I like having this just so I have that stuff with me. Next, I have a hairbrush. So obviously I have my wallet, so I have my ID and my, my money and all that funness that you have to have with you. Then I have a pencil pouch and I just have all kinds of like pens and colored markers and such. So if I get bored and I wanna write, I can. And also, uh, in case there's something I need to fill out, I'll have a pen on me. Makes it a lot easier. So the next thing that I have is my planner. And this is from Target, it's really cute. And it just has like the days and months in here. Makes it super easy to use. And I like planning out video ideas and what I'm doing and that kind of thing. So on the plane is definitely a great place to plan out stuff because you have a lot of time. Speaking of that, I also have a notebook so that I can write out ideas and all that. Plan out videos and write ideas and maybe draw if I get bored. So next I have gum. You need gum anywhere on a plane because it helps your ears from popping. Next in the big pocket I have all kinds of snacks. I have Fruit Loops, um, the Brookside dark chocolate things. These are so good. I also have a Kit Kat bar and some Mintos to snack on and to also keep my breath fresh. Lastly in the big pocket I have my laptop and I obviously need my laptop. Um, for obvious reasons, editing, uh, watching things, keeping myself occupied, writing things out. So that is everything in the big pocket, so let's move on to the small pocket. Let's open it up. So in the smaller pocket, the first thing I have is my hard drive. This holds all my videos, my backup, my storage, and everything. My computer does not have space to hold all of that, so it's all in here. This is essential to video editing. So I need this for the plane so I can edit on the plane. The next thing that I have is my GoPro camera, and this I obviously want for Hawaii because I'll be swimming and I want to do underwater footage for you guys. So. GoPro is essential. Then I have my smaller camera and this is more, I consider it my vlog camera, but it's not really a vlog camera. It doesn't have like the flip up screen and stuff, but it's easier to carry around than my DSLR camera. So I like to have this just to carry around. Next, I have a charging port for my phone in case I run out of power. This is great so I don't have my phone die on any of my flights or anything. So the next thing that I have is just a bunch of charging cords. So for my phone, my cameras, my computer, all that fun stuff, all those fun charging cords that you need, <laughs> but they take up space. And then I also have my earbud headphones from Apple. I like these just in case I need them. Next, I have my fidget spinner. And I just thought this is a good thing to have on an airplane 
because it's entertaining. So next I have just some lotion. This is just in case my hands get dry on the flight or anything and I might need lotion for any reason. Then I have it with me. Next I have just some hand sanitizer and I have this because airplanes, airports, traveling can be dirty and germ-full. So I like to have this just to make sure I don't get sick and that I stay clean. Next, extra hair ties. Having your hair on your face on a plane sucks and if your hair tie breaks then you're kind of screwed. So I like to bring extra ones just in case. Then I have some Advil just on the off chance I get a headache or something. It's nice to have it with you just in case. And um, <laughs> that's everything in the small pocket. So that's everything in my carry-on bag. I also bring my DSLR camera with me because I do not put my electronics in my chest baggage. That is not a good idea. I don't like the idea of having that lost or swollen or anything. So I like to keep it on me at all times. And I suggest that for everyone else. Actually, the one thing I forgot to show you that I have not packed yet and I need to is an extra pair of clothes in case your luggage gets lost. It's nice to have something to change into when you get to your destination in case your luggage gets lost or it's delayed. That's just a helpful tip and I think that you should always have that with you. And speaking of that, go watch my travel life hacks video from last year. I'll have it linked in the description box down below. Go check it out. It has a lot of helpful tips for traveling. So that is everything that's in my carry-on bag. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful or entertaining or something like that. Again, make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on Hawaii videos, back to school videos, and all different kinds of videos. Yay! Yeah, so that's all I have to say. I guess I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!